it gets hard in. But uh, yeah, it should be fun. This is the uh, stage two clutch and flywheel kit from Platinum Racing. This is just a little box from Z1. I have steel clutch lines and I'm gonna be rebuilding the slave cylinder as well. And then here is, I think this is the clutch in here. Yeah, so we got the clutch right here and then the pressure plate is down below underneath it. And then in this one, we have the lightweight flywheel. If I can get it open. There we go. Finally got the flywheel out. Just an update, it's probably like four hours since the last thing I posted, or since the last thing I recorded. But we got the new flywheel, new clutch, and the new pressure plate all bolted up. But we do not have a torque wrench to torque the pressure plate onto the flywheel. It has to be at 25 pounds, and so it's pretty soft. That you don't want to over torque that, so that's the one thing we for sure have to have to torque down. Um, other than that, the throwout bearing has this little thing on it. it uh, let's see, let's see if I have it here. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to really see it, I don't think. But if I hold it in front of this, maybe I don't know. It has this little thing on here, and you have to have to get this you have to press this out and we don't have a press so I'm gonna take it somewhere tomorrow we're gonna get it pressed out and then press it into the new throw out bearing so we'll have that done and then other than that all we have to really do is re-put the throw out bearing on um, we got to stab the transmission back into it get it all lined up bolt it back up and then pretty much just start putting everything back together bolt up the trans again bolt up all the uh, the slave cylinder um, we're gonna do a steel clutch line tomorrow as well so we'll do that bleed the lines we got to put my exhaust back all that good stuff I will see you guys tomorrow good morning it is now uh, day two this is that throwout bearing that I was talking about last night the one that had the sleeve in there and we had to, I had to press it out I just got that done so this is the old one and then this is the new one with the sleeve pressed in there see how it doesn't have as much play so yeah all we need
need to do is get a torque wrench and we're good to go.